into the VAC paint shop or build across paint shop. Scarlett's, <laughs> Scarlett's going on vacation. I'm Sarah and I'm here to paint for you today. This awesome oval pumpkin shape. I was going to do some Christmas, but it's like we haven't even made it to October 31st yet. So I wanted to jump back into the fall stuff. Yeah. This is uh, one of the designs that Scarlett and I came up with together. And it's an overlay, oval pumpkin shape. You could use it as a door hanger. You could use it even like in your entryway. You could lean it on the buffet for the family Thanksgiving. You could use it for lots of things. It would, I think that this would look really pretty like leaned in an entryway or uh, like I said, on a buffet, like just against the wall in the backdrop. Yes. Colby's going to come talk to you about some kettle corn stuff too. While I'm painting Although it. Although would be smart to wait until people tune in. So, oh, yeah. So. <laughs> Got a huge kettle corn sale going on. We do have a huge kettle corn sale going on. I'm going to stain this background, which is a white pond with Tobacco Road. Tara said hi. They're watching you on the big screen. In the hi. Car. Everybody's watching so they can make fun of you. Yep. That's what they do. <laughs> <laughs> No, I, I miss Scarlett. I have so much fun painting with her. Like, I don't know. It's like we were together and then we weren't together painting and now we're back together. And like, she's the kind of person like I'll bounce. I trust her opinion. I'll ask her, you know, does this look good or what color would you use on this? If she wants something done, she'll ask me. Like, it's we vibe together well, just like Tara and I do. Uh, we have a and Billy. And, uh -huh. <laughs> Billy's another. Uh, Billy's another uh, issue. And I got a new chair today because Tara got a new chair, so I'm really excited. <laughs> so I'm actually like sitting in my chair. I'm not sitting up on pillows, which is pretty cool. Uh, so I'm definitely missing them this week. I don't have anyone to talk to in here except Billy. Wah, 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 wah. I don't I think much of that either because BJ's off. BJ's off. So, anyway, is anybody, I mean, is everybody like in Christmas mood now? Are y'all still doing fall? Because I feel like fall is getting like just forgotten over here. Everything. We have a lovely backdrop that Scarlett made for Christmas, but it's like fall, fall's still here. In fact, it just finally started to feel like fall. I mean, is it cooled down for y'all any? It's just getting everywhere. I should have worn gloves. Billy. Yeah, you want gloves? No, it's no. too late now. I want you to Which, talk to me, though. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm Why is it whenever you do something with your hands, your nose itches, and you have to, like, scratch your nose? Oh, it's the devil messing with you. It's just the devil. He wants you to put a little... Staying on the nose. It's just the devil. All right. So the only thing about this uh, Dixie Bell stain that you have to like get it wiped in just the right. It's not like like real stain where you can just let it seep in because this will leave streaks if you don't uh, wipe it to just the right. Which one was it? Tobacco Road. Tobacco Road. Which were just about out of it here. Too. Is that a song? <laughs> uh. I don't know. Tobacco Road. Never heard of it. I feel like it's a country song. I don't listen to country Sounds like it would though. be. Um, we, uh, just so you know, we actually have a store location in Bastrop with all of the Dixie Bell supplies and paints. Um, I try to keep it stocked with at least two of every color. Yeah. So if you're needing something in a pinch and you're close enough or we can ship to you, let us know. This is gross. Now I have no candles. I feel disgusting. Okay, so that's the backdrop. Now I'm going to paint the top. It's a good looking stain. It is. Before I start on the top, you want me to show them the tree? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Your finished tree. This is something that I designed mm -hmm. recently as a, like a table topper or, um, really like an end table toy for kids to play with if you're going to have company at your house or grandkids it comes fully apart there's the star which i just used some cotton paint and put a little glitter on it i used all blues for this this is hank blue this is the gulf 
This is Dusty Road, or Dusty Blue. I got that road thing. Road. This is Vintage Duck Egg. I like that color a lot. Wait, is that vintage? No, this is Sea Glass. I'm the sorry. Next one's this is Sea Glass. This is Vintage Duck Egg. And this is Cotton. I wanted to do something besides just solid white, which you could totally do solid white. And then the tree yep. comes apart like that. So you get all of this in a bag, and you can paint it and put it. Let the kids put it together. I think it would be cute in a teacher's office, like for your kids waiting to talk, or at the counselor's office. It just reminded me of uh, that little Fisher Price toy where you stack the donut things on there. Yeah. I mean that's what it looks like. And you can it use always reminds me. Any colors. But it's fun. So we have this on our site. What's it called? Freeze dry standing snowflake tree. That's yeah, a snowflake Christmas tree. Um, it may have the word freeze standing. I'll look it up. It probably has the word freeze standing. Precious. It is a stackable snowflake tree. Stackable snowflake MDF tree. Craft project. I'll put a link. Okay, so for this part, uh, I'm going to, you could write something right here. We could cut a word for you, pumpkin, uh, hello, welcome, grateful, thankful, blessed, live, laugh, love. I'm trying to see which way this goes. I guess it doesn't matter which way you want your, curl, your pumpkin curl to go. Yeah, I guess they would just pick when they get it. There's yeah. no uh, etch lines on it. Anything, nope, so. it's just cut out. So I'm gonna paint the uh, Christmas or the pumpkin orange. Do we want Colby to come talk yet? Yeah, it'd be a good time. I don't. He probably didn't ran off. It's, hey, Colby. Is he over there? What? Come talk about kettle corn. Come about y'all's amazing deal you have going on. It is pretty good. It's, it's uh, it's the equivalent of forty percent off. Really? But they're getting good. there. They're it's five large bags for thirty bucks. He's gonna tell you all about. It. Ooh, look at that! Yeah, I'm coming out of all kinds. Of I know, man. We are gonna get to that here. In a yeah. Minute. He's like a used car. Where's that? Yeah. Right here. <laughs> How y'all doing? Uh, yes. Uh, I think building spilled the beans. Oh, a little bit. I mean, that, that but was... look, today uh, we started it yesterday. Uh. All the large single bags that are normally 10 bucks are on sale. Uh, you can pick any five you want for 30 bucks. Uh, we was going to do it yesterday, but we're going to spill the beans a little early today. We're going to extend that sale until tomorrow at noon. What? Yep. So you still got a chance. Uh, Get them while they're hot. Normally it would have ended in uh, 48 minutes, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, eight minutes and then at noon it'll end it. But we surprise, surprise, we have extended the sale. Uh, it is a good sale. Uh, you get a fifty dollar value for the price of thirty bucks only. You can also uh, stack your savings and 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 double up and stack the deal uh, and get free shipping if you spend sixty bucks. What? We'll pay the shipping if you spend sixty. Uh, that's on all the singles. Uh, just to give you a little heads up and and. And have a little awareness of the the three bag listings on our website, like a three bag combo for, for thirty. Those are not the those don't qualify for the for the sale. It's it's single. So if you want three bags of caramel, three bags of Chicago, three whatever, you got to go to the single listings, the ones that are ten dollars, and just put three of them in your cart, and that'll get you you know your sales. Ooh. I know we had people do that. You know, before and ask why it ain't getting the, the automatic discount at checkout. Yeah. You got to order from the singles. You got to order from the singles. It's but all the flavors are there, right? All the flavors, yeah, all the are, flavors are there. So you're not missing out or lose, not being able to get a flavor, but you can't go to the three bag special and click it. What about free shipping? We got some free shipping going on too. Yeah, if you spend sixty, spend sixty for free shipping. Yep. And that includes the other deal. That's that's include. Yeah, you stacking it. Man. We call it stacking it. So they can load up. And yeah. Then, People don't know they can store their kettle corn in the freezer for a little while. Uh, yes. You know, they don't want to use it all right then there. That's what I do. And then I put it in the microwave for like 20 seconds and it gets all hot and warm again. Yeah, my wife had had some from some deal flavor uh, from camping one time. 
uh, it, it had to be over a month, you know. <laughs> yeah. And she pulled it out. We was watching the movie, and I thought it was some corn she just had popped. Yeah. You know, until I tasted it and realized it was the deal. And I said, where'd you get that? She said, oh, I had it in the freezer. Yep. That's from last month in Canton. <laughs> I said, well. And it was good, you know. Um, yeah. So you, it does last as long. I mean, I don't think it does an expiration date whenever you put it in there. Mm -hmm. you pull it out yeah. and eat it. Um, but look, we do want to give a little shout out and give everybody that's watching a heads up on these little cute grip jars. These are 32 ounces. Uh, we made we boxed up 150 of these today for uh, Miss Rita. She's gonna come yeah. pick this up today at two o'clock. 150? 150 of these for a baby shower. Oh, yeah. that's, that's why she ordered. Idea. That's why she ordered them pink and white. Yeah, it's for a baby we shower do, for her daughter. Custom, uh, we do custom coloring. We do custom mixes if you want. If you want to do large uh, bulk, content, you know, do a bulk for an event. Uh, we can. Yep. We can Banquets, kind of uh, family reunions, uh, ginger reveals is real good because you can do blue or pink and surprise the, the guests with the, the ginger reveal like that with these. And we do have three options. Uh, we got the 32 ounce, the eight ounce, and the 64 ounce. All the fall festivals coming up. That's good. Like if you're having a fall festival at your church. Yeah, we we got pumpkin spice flavor. Uh, we're gonna be listing on the website pretty soon. Um, for the, this time of year, we're gonna drop it in Canton this weekend. Yeah. Uh, you know, and see how it does and everything. I want to try that. But. <laughs> <laughs> Just to give you a heads up, we, on all them orders, you have to call in. The price varies depending on the, the quantity you get. Yeah. You know what I mean? So uh, we do have these already listed, you know, in all the flavors online at a set price, and that's what they are. But right, right. If you do an event and you need a bunch of them or whatever, we can work with, you know, it's, a, it's called a custom order. And that listing will be also updated soon, but it, it's available now if you call and want to place an order, you know. We have a website. What is it, Papalot? It's papalotkettleporn.com. Papalotkettleporn.com. Uh, I'm sure Billy put, put it the in. Link in. I gave that out last night. Somebody tagged me in a post where someone was asking where y'all were at the mall. Mm -hmm. You want to give them a bag away today? They couldn't find you. Yeah, we sure can. Uh, y'all make sure you share today. Share our live feed right now. Uh, that's going to make you eligible for our drawing. We're going to give away two prizes today. Um, we'll give away one of our stackable Christmas tree sets uh, that she showed you. And uh, you want to give that away? Or you, you want to give an unfinished one? Unfinished. We'll give a bag of kettle corn to each of you winners, too. So thank you. Thanks, Colby. Yeah, shout out again to Ms. Rita. Shout out, Ms. Rita. <laughs> yeah, she, 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 she ordered 150 it. of these things. Pink and white mix for a baby shower. So, I'm painting all my little sides. I know it takes me a little bit longer than Scarlett. I just, I don't know. I have to. <laughs> it's a compulsion. I can't leave them unpainted. But uh, that's a really good deal. And the flavors of the kettle corn are really good. My favorite right now is banana. You like banana a lot, huh? I, I liked it, too. Um, it tastes like... Banana candy, like the uh, Laffy Taffy or something. That's what it reminded me of. Laffy Taffy. Yeah. I liked it because we put chocolate on it. <laughs> One of the chocolate. That was the definitely. Chocolate made it really that good. was really exclusive. Yeah, that was good. You can always count on those uh, on Tara or Scarlett, those Brent girls, to come up with some good uh, food ideas. I'm talking to Tara and cook and bake. She's a baker. And even her daughter, like they make the best cakes and stuff. So, anyways, what are we talking about? Anything? <laughs> I, don't I don't know. know. I'm just talking. We have so much painted work going to Canton this month. Like Scarlett said, she hadn't ever painted this much for Canton. And like, we'll send it out. This yeah. is going to be a huge Canton month. I feel it. Like everybody, all the vendors. It was picking up last month. But I think this month's going to be huge. And I wanted to tell you all about becoming a wholesaler on our thing. Because oh, yeah, I've had a important. lot of questions lately about that. I'm not talk about that nearly enough. I know. Um, becoming a wholesaler with us means that you get 50% off. And it is so easy. All you have to do is go to the website and click the link and fill out the form. And... 
snap a picture. Like, you don't even have to fax things these days. Snap a picture on your phone of your, uh, of your business license and your tax ID and send it to us in an email. Fill out the form, create a username and password. It's so simple. You make an initial purchase of uh, $200, which in reality is $400 worth of stuff because you get 50% off. And this is a great time of year to do it because you're already, if any of you are selling this stuff, you're already making these big orders. So you might as well become a wholesaler at the same time. And it's totally worth it um, for people who feel like that's overwhelming going online and doing stuff like that. You can call our shop and talk to Casey, and she can help you do that, walk you through it. Um, I've spent many times over at the thrift store doing that for people, just sitting on the phone with them and helping them make their order and helping them decide what size they need. And Because sometimes, you know, when you get on there, it feels overwhelming when you're looking at, like, inches, and you don't know. Yeah. what size you need like we will be happy to tell you yeah we have to help people out with uh words and things like that yeah things, like so it's fit a certain space yes we, we can help you decide that we can tell you what's uh standard like i would say 18 to 20 inch is a standard door hanger size um so there's lots of things we can help you do but becoming a wholesaler is a big one we have thousands thousands tens of thousands how many shapes oh my goodness i don't know <laughs> we I have mean, we have almost eight thousand listings on the site um but you know that lot. that includes things in various sizes um, so yeah i mean we do all kinds of stuff there's a lot of custom listings involved there so it's yeah. a lot of stuff i mean you really really are getting a good deal um and the thing about it is too like we we do custom work if there's something you're wanting and we don't have it on the website, shoot us an email. We'll talk about it. We'll see if it's doable. Most most things are doable. Um, unless they're trademarked or copyrighted, most yeah. things are doable. I think, like, the only time I have to tell people that we can't do something is that if they're trademarked or copyrighted. Yeah, or um, one big thing we, we can't do is, like, college um Sports. sports teams and stuff like that yeah but i always like we'll help you with alternatives too because i yeah. always tell people you can instead of doing the call like the okay so instead of doing the razor right because i'm from arkansas you could order an arkansas state and paint a razor back on That's it right. or you know have have something it's it's there's more to it I'll say it like that uh this two-piece set that you're painting today is available for only 32 dollars $32. Comes with a, I believe, a 22 inch white pine oval. It's pretty and then big, the, yeah. Uh, quarter inch overlay cut out. It's pretty big. You could uh, do so many things with it. I just yeah, and we've got some other. This was uh, introduced as a as a series. There were four different pieces similar to this that all had the same look we had a circle one i think we did an octagon or hexagon, hexagon. One maybe. um so there's a few other things on there too i get the link for this piece. yeah hexagon um you and i'm painting a stripe one here because i saw a picture of it paint of something painted like this and i like the way it looked all i did to put this stripe on here because it's not paint this part's not painted on line um all i did was literally laid something across it that we have one of our uh is this like a boho pattern that we have yeah yeah it is i just it's laid like it a, across and drew we had a couple different ones drew a pencil on, yeah. on it yeah we have these little shapes on our website too like there's one that has the v in it and like if you're wanting to um stencil on a wall yeah <laughs> we, yeah we used it as a stencil more than anything it's pretty cool i mean that's what it <laughs> is yeah. it's a stencil but we've had people um, get them. I've seen them painted and just hung on the wall as like a three piece set. Oh, yeah, really? Yeah, well, that sounds cool. It's real boho y. So now I'm using a uh, cotton. No, this is fluff. I like using fluff, it's not as bright as cotton. I'm just kind of freehanding this edge. If I were going to be like super precise, I might put down tape. I love, that's one thing that I love about a sponge brush is being able to make a straight edge because they're flat. 
Uh, once again, we're asking uh, that you publicly share our live to your personal or group page to be considered for today's giveaways. We have two giveaways. One is going to be the uh, Snowflake freestanding Christmas tree that we showed earlier, and one will be this kit. Yeah. That Sarah's painting. And we're also going to include a free bag of kettle corn with each other. So. Any flavor? Uh, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> Dealer pick. They're, they're out there. They're, we're going to get something good and send it to you. Probably be a classic Ooh. flavor, something like caramel or, or caramel. Caramel. <laughs> whatever, whatever, you, whatever you say. You say caramel? I say caramel. I say you say caramel. caramel? No, I say caramel. No. But I also will say whatever the other person says. I took one of those like quizzes recently where your dialect says you're from. And I straight got Arkansas and Alabama. Which was crazy. What's the Alabama part? I, mean, I don't know. Okay. It was like, what do you say? Like, instead of y'all or you all or, you know, it was like yeah. one of those kind of quizzes. You guys. You guys. Hey, you guys. I picked up you guys. For a long time. That, that's kind of northern. It is. Yeah, I, Iowa is where I, I guess I could go. When I lived in Illinois. I didn't want to sound like I was from Louisiana. <laughs> when I lived in Illinois, I used to answer the phones uh, at, <laughs> is it, at this place, photo place that I worked at. And people, I'd say, Hi, hello, can I help you? Or whatever. And people would say, Where are you from? Louisiana's are hard to hear, especially the ones Have you ever lived in Louisiana until I lived recently? here uh, for like a year in 2005. Okay. But I've lived in Florida, Oklahoma, Illinois, Louisiana. I've lived a lot of places. Louisiana. Louisiana. I still, I say Lafayette. People from here say Lafayette. What do you say? So I have to I say Lafayette. I have a bad habit of, of uh, switching. I saw this, uh, I don't remember if it was a Facebook video or, or something of uh, some New York cops, I think, that were down in New Orleans, maybe, helping yeah. after a hurricane. hurricane. Yeah. yeah. And they were like showing them all these different like French words and stuff like that that are part of our normal, normal. The yeah. conversation yeah. normally. But, um, and <laughs> just asking them to pronounce them because a lot of those things sound nothing like what they're spelled. No, they don't. It was funny to watch. I still have trouble. Yeah, if I, it's not something you would know except being taught. Like they have a lot of um, like Native American uh, words and stuff like that. I think it's more French. It, uh, there was a, a combination of, of the two and the ones they were looking at, like Wichita. Because uh, the. Uh, the native, I think, like I hear, I had all those in, when I lived in Oklahoma and Florida. Like everything is a native name. <laughs> what? Yeah, that's true. Um, also, we have a coupon code right now, Scarlet30. Anybody watching, if you want to shop on our site for unfinished wood craft cutouts, you can use the code Scarlet30 to check out 30% off. It includes everything except Dixie Bell. Yes, except Dixie Bell. Do you have anything you want to say, Casey? <laughs> She's busy. She just made a drive-by. She ain't got time for that. She straight made a drive-by. Do we have anybody watching? <laughs> yeah. yeah, of course we got people watching. Okay. Whatever. Anyways, this this little part right here is probably the trickiest Pretty part. Good. It's going to be getting into these little grooves. I'm going to use the sponge brush to do it. Um, quickly so that I can finish this up for y'all. Shirley, who's uh, from Arkansas, said that her husband is from New York and she still has trouble understanding him even after 38 years. <laughs> so. <laughs> he has a northern accent. I like that Boston accent, though. <laughs> Forget about it. Oh my gosh, I painted into them. This is really a lot of little spaces to get in. So I might not get in them all just for this. <laughs> uh, oh, here's another one. Evelyn from Georgia. Uh, she went to California and they would just ask her to talk. Ask her to <laughs> yeah, talk. Yeah. Talk. That's how I am. 
when I go places. That's how, when I was a kid, I went to Iowa for like a couple of weeks. Uh, that's how they were over there too. Say something. Like, <laughs> Just say something. Just say something. My grandmother was a Southern Belle. She had a great accent. Just killing their dabas and drinking iced tea. Oh, I snorted. You snorted? <laughs> uh, okay, I'm getting some of these little drips before I lay it on my board. Because I do plan on finishing it. I'm going to show y'all how cute it is. Do you have a winner picked out, Billy? Oh, I was going to give them the whole bunch of people share late in the video. Okay. So I'm going to consider everybody. Consider the choices. Okay. So, do you think some people would use that as like a name frame or something? I mean, that's what I thought of with the uh, the big white panel going through. Or the well, I I would think that you would you could use it as a name frame. You could put your last name on it. You could put gather. You just depend on where you're gonna put it at. Yeah. Gather. Welcome. Hello. Just any little saying that you would want family i still like if you put it in an entryway or on a buffet you could put the so-and-so family gathers here or or even just a simple word like grateful gratitude like that's my big thing so i like this time of year i think living a living a grateful life keeps you humble as long as you're grateful, you're humble, and you're appreciative of everything that you have, and blessed. Push that towards me, please. Oh, yeah, okay. So, the final. I like it. it looks good. Here we go. There you go. Bill. I like it. Do right. so you like it? I like it. <laughs> Who's our winner? Um, okay, for the Christmas tree giveaway, along with a bag of killed corn, it's going to be Shirley Hallett. Shirley Hallett, you're the winner for the Christmas tree. This right here, um, you'll receive one unfinished in the mail. Email us at support at build a cross cross.com. Cross yeah. <laughs> I can't say it like Scarlett. Bill A dash com. <laughs> She's probably said it a million times by now. In case he'll get back with you and ship that out to you. And then what's that? Who's winning this? That uh, Evelyn Morgan Sapp. You also win. You're gonna win. Uh, did you say finished? Unfinished. 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 Yeah, unfinished. Boho pumpkin kid thingy. <laughs> Whatever it's called. And we want to see a picture of it when you finish it too. So email Evelyn. Email us at support at build dash a dash cross dot com. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Thank you so much All for right. watching, we'll and we'll be back, back tomorrow. tomorrow with, and I'll probably do something Christmas tomorrow. Thank you. Bye.